Hey, my YouTube friends and YouTube world. How are you doing? You surviving 2020? Don't let it get you down, guys. We can do it. Keep going. Stay strong. 2020 has brought a new surprise for me today. So, let me give you a little background to the story. And I'll make it a uh, long story short. You all know that I'm an advocate for Mother Nature. It's important to give back whenever we can, and I always do. So I have many birds. I take care of the birds. I have a bunch of nests and a bunch of baby birds. They're so sweet, okay? So um, what I noticed that I was having a house cat, not a feral cat, a house cat that's been coming by a few nights every week. And I don't need this creepy cat hunting down my baby birds. I don't know why people let their house cats run wild. It is not acceptable, it's not okay. Do your research. They are invasive. If your cat's in my yard, it's gotta go and I'm gonna take care of it, got it? So, what I did was get a cat trap. A not, uh, no harm, no kill, just catch it. I was going to catch the dang cat and then take it to the main society. Get rid of it. It's the same one over and over. Because some dumb people just let it wander. So, uh, I got the cat trap, sat it out there for about a week or so. Um, cat kept coming by the front instead of the back, so whatever. I just kept it out there. Um, patience is a virtue. But last night, I caught something but it wasn't a cat I got a possum a pregnant possum and she crawled into the cage and gave birth in the cage last night true story so now I have the cage open and I'm waiting for her to leave and I'm not going to physically touch her or anything but she is so sweet and she lets me get close to her and she shows me all the babies in her pouch. It is absolutely amazing. Beautiful. She doesn't hiss at me or anything. She'll just lay there. So my plan is to just keep the cage open and when she's ready to leave, she'll leave. Possums are very transient. They don't stick in one place long. But guys, the babies are like half the size of my pinky. Half of it. Okay? They're, they're, they don't have eyes. Their skin is, tr it's like a transparent. It's see-through. They're so sweet. And she's, they're all in her little marsupial pouch. So, I'll keep you updated on my possum adventure. Okay? Let's really hope everything turns out okay. Because I can't deal with any any other sad story here in 2020. Okay? Wish me luck. And I'll keep you updated. Talk later. Mwah! I just woke up so I have my tired eyes on <laughs> but I needed to tell you right away that my possum 
left. I, in, I covered parts of uh, the sides of the cage um, so animals couldn't easily get to her or her babies because she was so delicate and fragile. And um, about halfway through the night, she left. There was no sign of struggle, all babies gone. It looked really nice. So, it's a happy ending. Thank goodness. And I'm glad I could help her out. I'm glad I could be a safe space for her to have her babies. Remember to take care of our planet, guys. We only have one. It's our home. Okay? Have a great day.